Hi, this is a short tutorial on how to solve the control room puzzle in um, on G-Deck. So between the engine room here and the turbine room here. Um, obviously, uh, the sailor isn't going to let you through um, into the engine room, and he, but he's going to let you know that this boiler uh, control isn't working. So you can um, get through to the boiler by clicking on a series of these um, dialogue options, um, but we'll just go through this way. So here's the boiler control. You have the condenser, the seawater pump, the freshwater pump, the boiler control, um, and then these two switches which maybe control the water tank, um, but it doesn't really say what these two do. So. Um, so we're going to look at the manual. Um, I'll just show you how to get to the manual. So you just uh, don't solve it. Uh, you click OK and he'll come back and be like, what's it's wrong with you? And uh, But you just say, I need some advice. Here. Take a look at the so uh, he gives us the instruction manual. Um, if you want to pause it to read the, uh, the hints or read them on um, the wikia, you can do that this uh, but I'm just gonna click out and solve it using this method so just click let me try again right there's a gauge showing the turbines um so again we're back here uh, the first thing the manual says is to turn all these uh, counterclockwise all these red wheels then the next thing it says to do is to adjust the seawater pump uh, to three quarters uh, full so we're gonna put it right here over the eye exposing the H. So you can already see that we're right up to the green already. Um, the next control we're going to do is boiler control. So again we want it three quarters um, to high on high and uh, how you do that is I mean it's pretty this with this solution the boiler control is pretty flexible but I generally put it here over the uh, wings of the arrow. So this has solved the boiler uh, using this method, um, but you have to finagle with every single uh, every single switch except for this, the fresh water pump. So I'm just going to unsolve it, and we're going to try a different method. Still running too rough. So just click let me try again. Um, obviously, if you're playing the game, you wouldn't want to try different methods, but. Uh, yeah, that's how you get back in here. Um, this time we're going to start with the boiler control, put it over the uh, with fins on the arrow under high. Um, then we're going to try this fresh water pump. Just uh, throw the switch over the LO. Um, yeah, so that it's covering both. Um, then you're gonna s move this switch over the I. You can see that we've already solved the puzzle just using these three switches. Um, so yeah, you want the seawater pump so that the H is exposed and the I is covered. Um, if you were going further, uh, if this puzzle hadn't been solved, it was still hovering over 60 or 80, you um, can move this counterclockwise and it'll just pop it in. And sometimes even this one won't work, so you might have to um, move this one counterclockwise. Um, but with this uh, particular time, because all the switches are set randomly whenever you look at it, um, with this attempt we solved it using three switches instead of using four or five, which uh, is pretty good actually. So you just click OK, and he tells us we're brainiacs, which of course we just read the manual and figured it out. Um, but now he's let us into the engine room, so we can go talk to Vlad. At this point in the ship, um, obviously, I'm just trying to get the Rubaiyat, but later you can come back to the boiler room and it again won't be set properly because apparently he wasn't paying attention when you fixed it, so you'll have to solve the puzzle again, and it's the same solution. It's not different from the first time. The only difference will be is that the randomized settings of the switches will have changed. So you'll have to, um, you might have to s s an angle with a couple extra switches if the settings are against you. Um, 
yeah, so that's the solution to the boiler control, and um, I hope you really enjoy playing this game, because I do.